Utah's news leader, Fox 13's Live at 4, starts right now. Right now, more attorneys all across the country are asking judges to accept lie detector tests as evidence. Well, as Fox 13 tech reporter Jordan Hogan explains, the tests we're talking about rely on your eyes to see if you're telling the truth. You've probably heard of people who claim to be able to tell if someone is lying just by looking in their eyes. Well, a Utah company called Converis says its eye detect technology can actually tell if someone is lying up to 90% of the time. Most people, when you say lie detector, think of a polygraph. We're nothing like a polygraph. A polygraph looks for changes in your heart rate, breathing pattern, and whether you start to sweat. Todd Mickelson, the president and CEO of Converis, said unlike a polygraph test, eye detect looks for changes in the size of your pupils and a few other things to see if you're telling the truth. You can learn how to control your breathing. You can learn how to relax, to not sweat. Uh, what you can't do is control these involuntary changes that occur in your eyes. Eye Detect uses an eye tracker to record changes in pupil size along with about 100 other factors, including how fast you read the question and how fast you answer. We capture about a half a million data points during a 15-minute test. This data goes into an algorithm which scores you on a scale of 1 to 100. Those who get a score closer to 1 are thought to be lying, and those who get closer to 100 are thought to be more truthful. I was challenged with lying to eye detect and not letting it figure out a number I had chosen. I picked the number 7. After a few intense rounds of questioning, I failed to trick the system. Games aside, more attorneys are now asking to include eye detect tests in criminal court cases. There was a case in the state of New Mexico where this was the case, and it was actually accepted by the courts as evidence. Attorneys submitting the tests as evidence are also submitting a polygraph test alongside them. Eye detect has an accuracy rating of up to 90%, and according to the American Polygraph Association, polygraphs have an accuracy rating of up to 83% when done correctly. The idea is that the accuracy of both tests combined should be enough to determine if someone is lying or telling the truth. In the end, it is up to the judge to decide whether they can be presented as evidence in the courtroom. In Lehigh, Jordan Hogan, Fox 13 News. Utah. Well, the defense team for Jared Baum filed a motion to have the result of an eye detect test and polygraph admitted as evidence. He's the man facing murder charges in connection with the death of Breezy Ottenson and Riley Powell back in 2019. Prosecutors do have until Monday to file their opposition to the motion. After that, the defense will rely to the opposition and then ask the court to rule.